everybody. I'm Jenny Anchondo along with Ron Corning and this is Morning After. It's 10:16, and it's time to check in with Lee Richardson. She comes to us from the Brain Performance Center. She's actually the clinical director and founder there. She's also an author of the book Turn Your Brain On, Get Your Game On. And we all we all need a little bit of that. Welcome Lee. Thank you. Thank you for having me. Well, uh, we weren't planning to talk about this, but now that health, direct, health officials have said you, we really want everybody to cancel, I would love to hear from your perspective um, advice for somebody if they were planning on getting together with the family for Thanksgiving. Maybe it was the first time they were planning to get together, and now they're saying that the numbers are going up in Dallas and Tarrant counties. They're feeling uneasy about it. How do they approach that with their family members if they want to now just a week out from Thanksgiving? Well, openly, very openly. It's interesting because I've had many conversations with clients and some family members think we definitely should get together and others are very concerned. And my recommendations to them have been be comfortable with your decisions. You know, if if you're not comfortable going because you, you feel like you've put yourself out into the real world too much, then be open with that. And it's okay if a family member is not comfortable with someone to uninvite them, mm -hmm. but uninvite them with an explanation. Tell them why, because safety, our numbers are going up. We all love each other. We want to be here next Thanksgiving. We got to focus on the safety. Oh, it's so hard, especially if relationships are already tender. Um, it's it's hard to have that. You know what I mean? But I think that that's I think that's great advice about. Imagine that, just being open and honest. Um, so we know that about 60% of Americans say that they are not traveling anywhere. <laughs> and now the onus is on them to produce this whole Thanksgiving feast. And a lot of times these are people who travel elsewhere, so they've never had to cook it all. And it can feel like a lot of pressure kind of for a first timer <laughs> to do all the, the shopping, the cooking, the, you find all the family recipes and stuff. What do you say to those people who are like, okay, it's game time for you a week out from producing this magical Thanksgiving you've never done before. Well, let's accept the fact that this year is different. It's very different. And everybody can cook something well. You know, play to your strengths. Make it a different year. Maybe you celebrate with a different cuisine. Maybe you get into it. Maybe if you're going to have Thai food, maybe you dress like the people in Thailand do. You know, we have to accept it's different and we have to get creative and appreciate it for what it is. Because if you're going to try to create that same meal that you've had somewhere else every year, you are going to be stressed out. Yeah, and you don't want to give off that energy. It's like the whole, it seems like, because I'm, I'm doing this exact thing. I'm asking because I'm doing this exact thing. I've, I've cooked the whole meal a couple of times, but it's been a minute. So I'm like, oh my gosh. Yeah, I want to recreate everything that my mother-in-law does for my husband and everything that my mom's done for my daughter so she learns the traditions and stuff. And it can be a little bit overwhelming. It's very overwhelming. Make it, make it all about you and your family. This is a great time to start new family rituals and have some new family memories. Oh, Lee Richardson, thank you so much. Uh, you are just such a calming presence, and I am so grateful for your time and for the advice for everybody. I also want to share their information. They do have a special offer for our audience as well. So again, it's the Brain Performance Center, and their act of gratitude throughout the holiday season is to give back to the community with this program called Breathe, which is truly going to show you the power of breath. So they're actually giving this program to the community. They have more on their social media and website, which you just saw up there. So <sighs> big deep breath, everybody. We'll make sure, we'll make sure this clip is of course online. So when you have a family member who's losing their, you know what, uh -huh. just send them Lee. She'll just calm you right down. She really does. She's so zen, right?